Hey you guys, it's Barb from Barberland Budgets and welcome or welcome back to my channel. I really appreciate appreciate you being here. In today's video, I am going to stuff my cash wallet and just a few sinking funds. So first, I'm going to shout out the BCL ladies for the week. Okay, you guys, it is week six of hashtag BCL Blue Heart. And this week, the budgeters are Hot Mess Budgets, GN Budgets, and ED on the Move. And of course, let's always support Budgeting April. So if you can go and give these channels some support, watch their videos, subscribe if you're not subscribed, like their videos, leave them comments. And if they have ads, watch their ads. Just do whatever you can do to support. I'm sure they would appreciate it. Okay, so now on to my video. Okay, so like I said, I'm just gonna do a quick cash stuffing. I am going to stuff, let me move this out of the way. Okay, you guys, your girl's back. I was having some te technical difficulties counting this money, but I got myself under control now. All right, so I'm gonna put the 50 down and count it last because that's where I was messing up. So now we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 3, 50. So we have $350 to stuff in our envelopes this week. And our sinking funds. Okay, so first up, I am going to empty out my wallet. So I didn't spend a whole lot this week. Just haven't been feeling super good and just, you know, just didn't spend a lot. So I did not spend my $10 in personal money. So there's 10. In dining out, I did spend some of this and I only have five, six, seven dollars left. You guys, I went to Mr. Hero on my lunch hour and I had the best Mr. Hero that I've ever had, and I, I don't feel bad about it. I did it when my kids weren't here because I didn't want to buy for them, and I don't feel bad about it. I just needed that Mr. Hero. Okay, so in groceries, we do have some rollover. We have $15. Look at you guys. I got some Sweet Baby Ray coupons that I got to use this weekend. I'm going to use those bad boys because I love Sweet Baby Ray's. Okay, so I had $10 left in household, $10 left in miscellaneous, and I had $10 left in pet care. So let's see how much we rolled over. So we had 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 61, and 62. So we're going to roll over the 62, and I am going to put these two singles in my buffer here that I use just in case we need to um, have a few extra dollars for one of my cash envelopes. So let's put that in here. Now we have 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, and 14. So $14 in my little buffer that I keep in my cash envelopes just in case I need, you know, if I'm $5 short on groceries for the week, I can just pull it from here instead of having to swipe my card. That's my plan anyway. It may not work out that way, but that's what I'm hoping for. I'm hoping that I don't continue to swipe my card because I have done that a couple times in the last two weeks so all right so that's it for that and now I'm going to stuff I'm going to set this money aside actually and then I'm going to stuff the envelopes okay so first up is my personal spending and I am going to put ten dollars in there I put ten dollars every week sometimes I spend it sometimes I don't I don't have an envelope for it, so I just put it right here behind the buffer. Dining out is going to get 20. Gas is going to get 20. So last weekend I did go 
to my daughter's college to watch her rugby match and I did go into my sinking fund and take $30 out for gas. So instead of having $100, I now have $70 on my sinking fund for gas. But that's okay. That's what it was there for. Groceries is getting $100. So now groceries has $50, $70, $90, $100. Household is getting 10. Miscellaneous is getting 10. And pets is getting 10. And once again, this week, my pets really shouldn't need anything. Maybe some treats. But they're still pretty good on their dog food. So, okay, that's it for my cash wallet. Okay, so this is the only binder that I'm going to stuff today with sinking funds. This is like my mid-level sinking funds. I do think that I might move some envelopes around. I don't know. We'll see. I just, I guess I'm just a little bit bored and I want to move things around and make it more exciting for myself. I don't know. But I'm thinking about moving some things around. So, in, in this binder, taxes is getting skipped. I haven't done my taxes yet. I should be doing them soon, though. Birthdays is going to get $10. So we're going to take a 10 out and give it a 20. So now birthdays has 20, 40, 60, and 70. And as usual, I will update these trackers off camera. Household is going to get $10. Yeah, I'm going to give it a 20 and take a 10 back. So now household has 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50. So I might spend part of this household money because the sink in my bathroom just will not drain anymore. I need to get it fixed. I have used, I have plunged it. I have used Drano. I have done everything I can possibly think. It's not working, so I'm probably going to have to have a plumber come out, and I'll have to take out of that, and that's okay. Health is going to get $10. So now health has 20, 30, 40, 50, and 60. Let me put two 10s back and get a 20. So $60 for health. Clothing is going to get $10. I'm just gonna add two fives. So now clothing has 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, and 30. So 130 in clothing. That's pretty good. I need to get my son some summer clothes. He's just growing so fast. And car maintenance is going to get $10. And I'm just gonna put two fives in here. So car maintenance now has 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 91, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. So 135 in car maintenance. And that's it for this binder. And last, you guys, I made the insurance payment for, it actually ended up being 1000 $320.44. It came down by $20 because I sold that other car that I had on there that it was a suspended suspended policy, so they were only charging me $20 some dollars for it. So I have made the payment and now I'm gonna start working towards my next six months with the remainder of the money there. I am going to start. I don't have this in a binder yet because I had taken it out because it was I don't know. I had moved it and I'm going to move it somewhere else now. I'm all confused, but whatever. So let's see what we're going to start it with. 20, 40, 60, 80, 91, 10, 20. So we're going to start it with $120. I am going to write that in here. So we have 120 and we will need... Just 1200 more in the next six months. No big deal. But anyway, so yeah, that is 
what we're going to start at now. And that's all I have for you guys. This was pr pretty quick and to the point, and I just wanted to get my wallet stuffed because it's the weekend and I want to go buy groceries and, you know, maybe my son's, um, his basketball season's over, but they're having the playoff for the league. And so he wants to go to that. So I needed, you know, to have a little bit of money to do that. And so thank you for watching. And I hope that you have a wonderful weekend and a, a wonderful week ahead. And I will see you on Monday morning with what did I spend this week? Not very much. I'm very proud of that. And I'm, I'm also going to show you guys where I'm at with my goals. So, all right, you guys, have a great weekend. Talk to you soon. Jesus loves you. I love you. And see you soon. Bye.